A filter is a great way to find multiple items that you're looking for in Access 2007. However, if you're just looking for a single instance of something or perhaps a few instances, then you'll really want to do a search. It's a little bit more efficient. So how you do a search is go ahead and open up your table. Click on the Home tab if necessary. Go over to the Find section and click on your Find button. This is going to bring up the Find and Replace dialog box. You want to make sure that your Find tab is the one selected. Now, in Find What, this is where you're going to type in what you're looking for. So I'm going to type in Adams right here. In Look In, you can either select to look in the whole table or to or to look in just the column that your cursor was in before you hit hit the find button. So I'm going to go ahead and do the whole table. You can choose to match a part of the field, the whole field, or the start of the field. So if you don't want to search for the whole complete word, you can only search, search for part of it or even just the beginning of that word or set of characters. So I'm going to go ahead and do any part of it is fine. In search, you can choose to search the whole table. You can choose to search up from where your cursor was or down from where your cursor was. I'm going to go ahead and stick with all. You can match case. So you can look just for lowercase atoms or you can search just for uppercase if you typed uppercase in the find what box. You also can choose search fields as formatted. So for instance, if you type the number 40, then it's going to find all the number 40s in your table. If you type in a dollar sign and then 40, and you want to only search fields as formatted, it's only going to find the $40, not all instances of the number 40. So I'm going to go ahead and click the Find Next button, and it found my atoms. So that's a quick way that you can use the search feature in Access 2007.